all right just a quick video for anybody looking to buy like a new one of these new high performance gaming laptops like this what you're looking at now is the new asus zephyrus m the gtx 1070 model and um love the machine but be warned this thing runs crazy hot out the box i'm talking about mid to high 90s on the gpu and cpu okay so what i had to do was um repaste it using um i just used the thermal grizzly hydronaut i'm not willing to play with any of that liquid metal stuff and additionally i will trust me if any of you are looking to actually play, use one of these machines i would suggest you look into undervolting as well okay so i think this runs up to like 3.9 4.1 out of the box what i've done i've capped my max turbo at 3.2 and additionally i reduced my cpu core voltage to four point was at 47.9 and i reduced my cpu cache to was it 100 minus 125 now with the cpu core i could have gone further around about the 60s but um i think my sweet pot spot is around about the 50s and again as i said i've just maxed my turbos to 32 okay 3.2 now with that alone, running those same games were hitting 90s. Now my CPU are hitting, is hitting around about 75 max, and the GPU is slightly less than that as well. And every game I'm throwing at it is still going above 100 FPS. If I was to increase that to 3.2, I might get, I mean 3.9, I might get another 5 F FPS. But the weighing up the additional heat, and when everything's G-synced, you probably won't even make notice the difference but again it's all up to you if you're willing to go with those crazy fans at full burst go for it i like to play my put my fans on balance or silent so this setup is good for me so again be warned this laptop ridiculously lovely super purchase but don't be buying it if you're not willing to repace and i would also suggest underclocking um if you're not looking to do that just get yourself get yourself like a desktop uh, that's my desktop GTX 1080 Ti um, hybrid walk, walk closed loop walk loop EVGA and a just said was that 7900K and again closed loop anything you throw at it not getting above 40 C's so yeah again laptop amazing but if you're getting a laptop with an 8750K processor or HQ processor sorry be prepared to put in some work or don't bother do it <laughs> don't bother do it all right